Welcome to SignFX. Let me show you how to create a content. We click on content. And on the screen, you can see the existing contents here. Uh, and also you can see the info. Uh, you can see the details of it. The expert ratio, the content name, and the last modified date here. And we have two contents. So at the left, you can see uh, the search function. If you have a lot of contents, you can uh, enter the keyword to find out the content you want to edit. Also, you can sort uh, the contents by name or date. And then also we have a bottom menu here to see the first page and the last page. The next step will be let me show you how to change the content name here. I click on the add the content name and uh, let me change demo one to demo. And that's it. So let me delete the demo content for you. Press the content, delete content, and then press the cross. Okay, I'm sure to remove this and it will be removed now let me show you how to create a new content which looks like this so we add on we add new content here you will see the content name this is the default name and the number represents today date and time and you can choose the orientation here is the preview area. If I change the orientation, you will see the preview. And let's choose landscape. And then we choose the aspect ratio here. Uh, okay. And number of regions. We have one regions, two regions. Now, uh, for two regions, you will see there are two templates for you. So you choose the one you want to. Three and four. So. Okay, let's use this one and click create. Here you will see the basic information of the scene. So the aspect ratio again and the duration. The, the default time is 300 seconds. So I will maybe I will modify it later. And uh, if you want to change the region, uh, so you can change here let's say five uh, and then drag along okay I think uh, four is good enough so I switch it back to four and click create so you need to know that uh, the excess regions will be deleted so it's better for us to choose to confirm the number of regions first before we add a lot of uh, contents inside so I will adjust the size and the shape of the content of the regions here I I can drag it in this way I want one more vertical region so I move it here okay and then uh, all right it looks good So I will add an image here. This is the first, first image I add. By clicking this icon or this icon, they are the same. And I can modify the pictures. Zoom in and zoom and then drag along or zoom out or fit to height or fit to width so this time I will do it manually I need to I want to make it bigger so all right it looks good this is the this is the first object and now I will add a URL here bbc.com and create 
so you need to make sure your computer is connected to the internet so you will see the real BBC website here and if I adjust the size of this region because it's a responsive website so I can see the layout changes and now I want to add a video here okay this video is here and this region I want to add a widget so we have default ridges and you can use your own one if you have and then this time I will add a digital clock so here are the uh, details you can modify with and I will click OK and then, OK let me adjust the size again OK OK so these are the objects and now I can add another pictures to, to here because uh, the duration of this scene is 300 seconds so uh, let me have one more picture here this is the second pictures I will say uh, each pictures will be displayed for 150 seconds because the whole the duration of the whole scene is 300 so I make it 150 so 150 150 okay it's okay now okay let me add some overlay to it uh, I want to add a logo to the top right corner here I just drag it there and I can change the size if I want to okay I put it at the corner all right and then I can add a widget I can add a overlay widget as well so let's try a calendar and, uh, I put it here okay it looks too messy so let's remove it I will click on the calendar and just press the delete button and it's gone and then I let me show you how to use highlight this is a text overlay uh, let's say welcome and I can choose uh, the front type and again I can just drag along to change the size of the object and its position make it bigger all right so now I can add a background music to my scene so I add I selected a mp3 file, let's listen to it okay it's a little bit too loud so I changed the volume okay so this is the first scene and let me add another one I will choose two regions for this time and this one all right and uh, this time I change the uh, duration to 150 seconds now let me show you a little trick here I can select multiple pictures for the region and click open you will see two image objects are added so okay let me adjust the, the picture a little bit and then the second one okay so now I can change the duration to 75 75 okay so here
can just change the I can just change the default duration here. So they're both 75 now. Now I will add a widget. Default widget. This time I will go for a text ticket. So this is the preview area. This is a welcome message. Hello. Well. Uh, okay. All right. So we have the second scene. Let me add one more for further explanation. So this time I will add a video here. Uh, also I will add a background music. So you ask me which audio will be played from, uh, in this scene. So if a video clip comes with an audio track it will have the priority to be played first so let's say if i have a video which contain no audio track the background music will be played instead this is the priority and then we created three scenes and here now i click the save button Finish. So now we have a new scene here. 